Can you really do that? I run. Thing? I ran. I just ran. You ran? I ran. Ran a little too hard, huh? Oh, yeah, unfortunately I did. Oh, yikes. Yeah, it hurts, Three, man. two, one. Bazinga. 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 Hey, you'll remember 3-2-1 penguins. Vaguely. You, re you remember how it was, like, disguised? Like... It's a Christian show. Did you realize that when you were a kid? I don't really remember watching it all that much as a kid, so no. Oh, I, I remember I like religiously watched it. Even was that a like pun? A show. Was that a pun? <laughs> was it pun? It was a Christian show. You religiously show, watched but, the... <laughs> but I, I was more interested in the show than, than, than religion. Yeah. And you so, were more interested in the <laughs> 1, 2, 3 penguins lore. <laughs> yeah, the lore of 321 penguins. <laughs> I'm gonna look it up. <laughs> There's probably some extensive, like, Wikipedia article covering the entire lore. Which, if so, would be absolutely hilarious to see. 321 penguins. There's and, a Wikipedia. And if so, what? There's a Wikipedia. Whoever did the plot summary on the Wikipedia page, I congratulate them. There but are three seasons. What? There are three seasons of 321 Penguins, and the first season started in 2003. Okay. And the final season ended in 2008. Wait, no, the show started. The first episode aired in 2000. Whoa. That was 21 years ago. What? 3 2 one penguins right? can legally drink. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad to see it's grown up. Um. So. There's no plot summary. There's no plot summary of 3 2 one penguins? There, there is a sort of a plot summary. Um, let me read it to you. Twins Jason and Michelle are spending summer with their British grandmum in the Perconos region of Pennsylvania. Grandmum has a collection of kitschy ceramic figures, the most prized of which is four penguins in a rocket ship. A honeymoon gift from her deceased husband. Wait, so they're called three to one penguins, but there are four of them. What a plot hole. <laughs> I'm ashamed of in, the of the failure of a uh, three two one penguins lore and continuity. Um, in the in the first um, video, the twins accidentally drop the ship, but instead of it breaking, it flies into the air and reveals the four penguins are actually the crew of a real spaceship. <laughs> what? One of what? the twins is in. Let me continue. One of the twins is then pulled into the ship using the crew's galazel device <laughs> and taken on a galactic adventure. The adventure that ensues then ties into whatever moral dilemma that Jason and Michelle had struggled with in the show's opening scene. For example, in the debut episode, Trouble on Planet Wait Your Turn, <laughs> Planet, the wait your turn. Oh crap, that was an the attention. Twins are struggling with taking turns playing a new video game and looking through their granddad's telescope before Jason is transported to a whole planet of alien vacuums. Alien <laughs> vacuums? <laughs> yes, they will really have trouble taking turns. <laughs> <laughs> Are you sure this is real? This is real. <laughs> this is 3 to one penguins. Oh, by the way, it's opening theme. Wait, no. It's opening theme is just the 3 to one penguins theme song. But it's ending theme 
is is called fly. How ironic, because penguins can't. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> they really shoot those penguins. They did. <laughs> okay, I wait, wait. So, um, the Gleasel. Do you want to know what the Gleasel is? Yes, I have to know what the Gleasel is. It's a shrinking device. Oh, that's not that cool. I mean, it's neat. I but know, like, right? It could have been so much cooler. A name like the Gleasel has a whole lot of opportunities to it. Yeah, I know, right? It could have just destroyed the universe if it were used correctly. Yeah. I mean, technically, shrink rays as an object can already do that if they were to exist. If you shrink ray a shrink ray, does it, it doesn't amplify its shrink effect? <laughs> that is a great question. So like if you galeasel a galeasel, does it make the galeasel that was galeasel have more galeasel effect? That's an amazing question. <laughs> I need um, to find the series creators. I have to interview them. I need to know more about um, the galeasel. The creator of the series is Jeff Parker. Oh, I, well, I got actually, there are three of them. So I'll get them all together Jeff. for a single interview. Yeah, there's um Jeff Parker, Nathan Carlson, and Phil Waller. I'm gonna have them all interviewed. Um, okay. Um, people in the Twitch chat, how many of you are there? Why don't you look? I can't see. Let me check. Twitch chat. Who are you? These games. Alright, hold on. Let me check. Um, if you're in Twitch chat, raise your hand. <laughs> <laughs> I'm I not see seeing any hands. Right now. Damn. Well, um, just a message to you in Twitch chat. Um, Cat. I require you to help me to piece together the three, two, one penguins lore. <laughs> Should I make my Friday streams dedicated to the three, two, one's Penguin Lord? <laughs> yeah, um, we're going to. Uh, well, first thing I'm gonna do is construct three, two, one Penguin's iceberg. Oh, uh, I'll do a I'll do a YouTube video on it on my main channel. Um, let, let's work on it together. Yeah, I I'll need just to like dedicate this. You know, we can make the Friday stream instead of casual speedrun streams. I'll make the streams three, two, one's Penguin's lore. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> Imagine getting to interview him on stream. That would be a poggers moment. No, it would. You can interview me on stream. In fact, you can right now. Yeah. Yo, rainbow split on Cap Kingdom? Poggers moment. Sorry, I just had to admire my rainbow split. No. Fair. I'd love to interview the series creator on stream. You can interview me right now, do it. Honestly, I think if I got the 3 to one Penguin series creator on stream for an interview, I would probably go from not affiliated to partner in a single night. <laughs> See that and be like, oh, this man? Like, this Twitch man wouldn't even make sure I have all the requirements. Like, they'd just be like, you know, we'll just partner you on the spot. Like, halfway through the <laughs> stream, I'll just get the notification that I'm now partnered. Oh, wow. Um... Anyways, interview me, Dad. Hmm. What do you know about the 321 Penguin's lore? Not much, but I know that a Gleasel is a shrink ray. And that, um. That's a good start. And that, uh, Jason Michelle's grandpa is dead. Yikes. And, okay, okay, theory, theory, theory. Okay, I just came up with a theory. Film theory time. Okay, okay, so, um, their grandpa is dead. His ghost possesses the penguins. <gasps> his soul was imbued into the penguins, uh, into the penguin figures upon his death. Ooh. That, that, could, Ooh. that could be interesting. Yeah, that could be interesting. I'll base my storyline off that. <laughs> You're gonna write a 3 2 one penguins fan function? <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> That honestly <laughs> sounds kind of fun to to do. Let's do it. Um, next question for me. Uh, 
Do you know if they sell any official DVD copies of the, all the episodes of 321 Penguins? I own a DVD copy <gasps> of some episodes. Do you have Do you have a capture card? I do not. Dang it, I was going to say we could capture your footage. <laughs> I need to say that. I wonder if they have like I mean, a series volume. Like, you know how like Adventure Time you can I mean, buy I could like, just, every single I could episode? Just, no, I could just connect a DVD player to my computer and record it on my screen. Oh yeah, that's right. I forgot they support <laughs> that. Yeah. Um, or you could come over to my place and we could just watch it together. I may have to. Stuff. Look at Andrew over and we'll, we'll marathon 3, 2, 1 Penguins. <laughs> I'll buy every well, episode you don't it. have. have yeah. um, I'll buy here. every episode you right don't back. have. I'm gonna go... Wait, no, I can't go upstairs. Dang it. Um, well... Say so I'll I'll buy all the episodes I I, on DVD yeah, that you don't have, um, and we'll series marathon. I'll give a have, like, yeah. three, I'll do a critical four, analysis three. on my YouTube channel of um three, two, one, of the three two one <laughs> penguin series and it's lower. Yeah, dude. Okay. Um, what else? What's your next question? Mm, I'm running out of questions. You're not the series creator. I, you you don't have all the you don't have all the the Next, lore. No no, don't ask me about three two and penguins. Ask me about myself. Um, how young were you when you were born? Zero. Yo, Rainbow and Cascade Poggers. Sorry, I just had another rainbow split. I was twelve when I was born. Ah, whack. See, we're born in like. I was born Sixth in 20, grade. You know? <laughs> yes. It didn't exist before middle school. Obviously. <laughs> you had to learn you to speak there. and everything right in the middle of middle school. Yeah, exactly. Ask Jesse. He was there. I don't know. I'm kind of scared to ask him. Oh, yeah. Everyone is. He's Jesse. <laughs> Yeah. He's a scary guy. He scares me sometimes. Sometimes I wonder if he's even real to begin with. I was gonna say something, but I'm not gonna say it. Oh, uh, so one time he was supposed to meet me at my neighborhood, and he went literally the opposite direction and went all the way to downtown Castle Rock and was confused. <laughs> <laughs> like, he man. called us and he's like, I don't know what park you're talking about. And Oliver was like, where are you? Well, I, I'm in downtown. What? <laughs> yeah, I, I took the right. Uh, you were supposed to take a right. Yeah, I took a right. Uh, no, you took a left. Oh. <laughs> it was an interesting experience that day. Jesse is a horrible creature. Yep. But, he's an interesting horrible creature. Yeah, definitely. Definitely a very interesting, horrible creature. One I could definitely get behind. I could, I could give him a firm handshake. Mm-hmm, yeah, so could I. Alright, next question about me. <sighs> Let's see. Like, I when... understand you're on a Twitch stream, but you can make these personal. Alright. At exactly what time did you leave for the bus Thursday morning? Thursday morning. Um, so, like, two days ago? Yeah. I left for the bus at, like, uh, seven? No, not seven. Six? Yeah, seven. At like, seven. Yeah. Alright, cool. <laughs> what is your home address? Live on stream, I'll clip it. <laughs> what is your home address? Oh god. I'm not doing this one. This is a dangerous thing. You said it could be one. personal. What is your social okay, security not, not number? Like <laughs> I don't even know my social security number. At which hospital were you born on what date at what time? Well, I was born... At, on November twenty first of two thousand five, but I don't remember. I don't. I don't remember what hospital <laughs> or the exact time. 
Um, let's see here. I don't. I don't think there was a clock there when I was born. Why wouldn't they have? Why wouldn't a hospital have a clock? Well, first things first. I was just born. I didn't know how to read one. <laughs> you you didn't leave so the responsibility the to someone else. <laughs> what's the point of having a clock if no one there can read it? <laughs> Are you just under the assumption that your parents can't read a clock? Because <laughs> that's what it yep. sounds like. Your parents can't read a clock. <laughs> Correct. <laughs> they never learned. They just don't teach them like they used to. Just don't beep. Rowdy, what do you want? You're whining. My dog's whining. Can you hear it? No. Oh, that's good. Yeah, he was just losing it. He does that sometimes. I can though. hear you whining. Mm, got him. Got him. <laughs> but sometimes he literally, it just feels like he's like, oh, I'm bored. Uh. Like it feels like he's just whines because he's like in the mood to whine. Like he's know it. Can you hear I you? Have, yeah. He's like, I have nothing scheduled for the next hour, so I'm just gonna complain. But like, it's like, do you want food? No. Outside. More like, no. More like. Go for a walk. Wait, wait. No. More like Chillery Clinton, am I right? Mm, got him. You really did it to him there. You showed him who's boss. You're a cat. What? That's all. all Who'd right. you like to see? What? Sage, the life you give, do you ever wonder where it's taken? Yes. I do sometimes, but I, I ignore it. Oh my I don't, god. I don't think about scary um, questions. Um, um, time machines exist in 321 Penguins. Yo, no. in 321 Penguins, there's time machines? Yes, there's time machines. Are you doing plot research on 321 Penguins? Yes, I am. <laughs> Fight a noble quest indeed. Keegan and Andrew are going to be so confused when they come back and we're having, like, critical analysis on the lore of 321 penguins. Go look at the Discord. Oh my gosh. I can't. I'm speedrunning. Wait, what are the names of, um, the penguins? Is that I gotta even know. mentioned here? Do they have canon names? I know Which one is named Vigil. Vigil? Mm-hmm. It's kind of a bizarre name, but whatever. There's probably yeah. someone out. It'd be funny if there's someone in the chat named Zigil and they're just like, bro, that's my name. Um, one of them is Kevin. I think one of them is called Kevin. Yo, that's my dad's name. So there's Zigil, there's Kevin. Zigil, um, Kevin, and... Dude, guy's name. there are three official 321 Penguins music videos. Music videos. Yes. <laughs> we gotta make the iceberg. <laughs> I can't wait to be a a lore and I can't wait late to be the lore master of three two one penguins. <laughs> oh no, the Galizal is broken in episode one of season two. What a way to kick off the season. I know, right? And then they have to uh, steal the space defreeze ship. The space defree ship. Wait. Yeah, that's whack. I want to. I want to hear the music videos at some point, but I'm worried they'll get copyright claimed if we do them on stream. Yeah, we might. Well, actually, um, Big Idea Entertainment. That's the guys who made it. Veggie Tales. <gasps> Yo, Veggie Tales creators made Three Two One Penguins. Yeah, they did. Whoa. So for good measure, we have to watch every single VeggieTales episode to see if there's any references. <laughs> the connected <laughs> Including universe. the reboot that's still going on. Including the reboot. 321 Penguins reboot win. <laughs> I know, they can't reboot it. They can't reboot it. They have to give it a season four. It's <laughs> just a continuation. <laughs> Even just better, I'd like them to just not acknowledge and just continue like there was never a cancellation. Like they were just... It just took a while for season four to come out. No, no, there was never a cancellation. It just took a really long time for. Yeah, them so to that's what they should act like. It's just like there was no cancellation. Yeah. 
Season three ended at episode seven, may I add. <gasps> they better make us an episode eight. We need a plot. I know, we, need right? a plot we need a plot finalizer. Um Yeah. So I'm just like I can imagine like they'll pick up the show again and like <laughs> the episode will be about one of the penguins dies. One of the penguins dies. When the kids are all grown up, like real life time has passed. Oh. The kids. Um, so Jason and Michelle are all grown up now, and like one of the penguins has died, making it true to being called three two one penguins <laughs> and not four three two one yeah. penguins. <laughs> so there are now three penguins. The kids are adults now, and like. Um, now they have to go on a quest to save the world because um as it turns out the spaceship actually transports them like really far away in the universe but the but there was a thing that they saw um let, let me find it um in uh okay there was an asteroid at one at like a yeah, in one specific episode, let's say that asteroid um, is like hurtling towards Earth, and when they're adults, the penguins come to visit them one night, like before they go to bed, and the penguins are like, "Yo, Earth's about to be crushed by this big old asteroid, bros." What do you, okay, Jacob, what do you yes. want the currency on your server to be? I was thinking like Dino Nuggets, like Dino Nuggies. Kagobri <laughs> Nuggets. Go. Can okay. I continue talking about the Over 3 2 penguins lore? Yes, we just had to establish the Discord server. I, I'm um, Gober Nugget? But Am the I the currency Gober Nuggets and you're the I'll currency like, master. Um, you want me to be the- <laughs> Your title should be the Gober Nugget master. We'll pick up where we left off. So, <laughs> the penguins come to visit Jake Shell after like- like uh freaking 13 years of no activity yeah and jason and Jill are adults now and so um the penguins are like yo there's an asteroid heading towards earth and earth is about to get freaking yeeted you gotta come help us yeah. um the galizal isn't working we can't shrink the asteroid and um so they have to like there's this huge like new turn of events in the series and um like it goes from being a Christian kids show to being like the most serious show of the 21st century. If there isn't an in-game final battle, then it's not good there, enough. <laughs> yes. There is an in-game final battle, and the boss fight is with the penguins themselves. Even better. Ultimate plot twist, am I right? Yeah. You know what would be even better for a plot twist? What? We meet the kids as adults, like everything you said, but just for fun, the kids, the now adult kids are like raging alcoholics. That too, that happens too. But like, when the penguins meet up with them, they come home like horribly drunk. Mm. Like they can't even... And, and, the, and the kids don't even realize it's actually the real penguins. They They think it's just them being drunk and the penguins are just like hallucinations or something but yeah. no they're the real penguins yeah like yeah. I think like the response is just ah oh, too many like, too oh, much whiskey oh. also can we talk about the um the disney overall canon not the pixar theory just the disney overall canon and uh how jungle book and zootopia fit in with each other way too well than they should Can we Does talk that about apply that? in Jungle Book? They're 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 yucky animals in Zootopia. They are superior. Yes, like um, that's plot in the Jungle right Book. There. You know how the how the monkeys like ooh, ooh yeah. I want to be like you. Well, eventually, over time, after humans are gone, because the animals killed them all, um, after that all happens, then the animals are like ooh, ooh I want to be like you, and then they become like humans, and Zootopia happens. That fits better than I thought it did. I'm actually now kind of scared. Yeah, I know, right? Because, like, in um, Disney, it's implied that all animals, conscious and have, like, souls and stuff, 
and are about as intelligent as people. And so, you know, them being intelligent as people have the full capability to, like, alter the entire course of their species or race or whatever. Because that's... Whatever they call it. Yeah. um, That's what makes us... I mean, that's one of the things that makes us human. You know? Yeah. We have the um, in we have the ingenuity or the drive to like say oh evolution um, we'll take it from here buddy you know yeah mm-hmm. yeah like we we denied evolution the right to change us mm-hmm. and now we sort of we can change it ourselves we can change ourselves yeah that was deep and like since animals are just as smart as humans in the disney universe like i can totally see it happening that uh you know the animals like rise up and they rise take over up. humanity <laughs> yeah rise like up the gamers, gamers. <laughs> yeah exactly and but... like in the ruins of human civilization which is how they have so many human-like things in zootopia um, they they like build their new cities and stuff in the ruins of human civilization, but they do it all better because they're not humans; they're animals now. Yeah. I mean, you don't see any pollution in the air in Zootopia City, do you? No, I don't. I may or may not have no, watched I, Zootopia today. <laughs> all right. <laughs> no, I like the idea of putting Pixar in the canon solely because I want cars to be in there. <laughs> That's it, I just went cars. Now hold up one second. Um, I'm gonna call the Super Carlin brothers and ask them how cars fits into the Pixar theory. Who? The Super Carlin brothers. They're the leading researchers on the Pix- on the Pixar theory. Oh. Shall we interview them on stream next week? I don't think that's possible, but if you want to try. What do you mean? Um, what do you mean? I could. I totally mean, the get Super Carlin stream. Brothers. I mean, you can try to contact them, um, but uh, the idea of the Super Carlin Brothers is that, I mean, the Pixar theory is that yeah. all Pixar movies, all movies made by Pixar, take place in the same universe. Yeah. Mm-hmm. That makes enough sense. Sounds sense enough to be true. I'll buy it. Um, they already have all of it done, but I don't think they've actually done anything for how Cars fits in with the Pixar universe. Did we just guess how Cars that. went off the rails? It started as a humble story about a racer and turned into, like, spies. Yeah, how'd that even happen? Um, let me look this up, how Cars fits in with Pixar theory. I gotta know this. This is some critical information. How does cars fit in. there it is the it's the first search result you just look how cars. does car and then it just it knows okay so okay um cars just takes place after humans leave the polluted earth the cars are either powered by by and large and syndromes ai technology what um or they've come to life through the power of their owner's memories good news everyone i think it's just about done i'm working on the server's picture now there's several pixar theories out there we're discussing how cars fits into the pixar continuity yeah so there's wally fun fact if they're in the cars movie there's a car pope so that implies that there's a, a car hitler yeah, I know. Oh, I want to meet him. Uh, so, uh room, room. what Coco kind of car would you be? <laughs> so, Coco takes place first. Of course, a bicycle. A bicycle. Stephen Hawking would be a bike. Oh, um, can I say something? <laughs> yes. The movie Brave. Yes. You know that movie? Yeah. Um, in the Pixar theory, you want to know when it takes place? <laughs> yes. Uh, Five thousand two hundred and one. The what? year, the year five thousand two hundred and one. I wonder where they got that. It's two thousand four. 
um, do you want to know when uh, when a bug's life takes place? Yes, I need to know when a bug's life <laughs> takes place. Twenty one. It takes place in the year twenty eight ninety eight. What? <laughs> Why is it in the future so much? Um, Why is so the bug life so advanced? <laughs> Pixar theory timeline. Let me look this up. All right. Um, okay, I'm gonna die again until I'm done. You're gonna love this. You're gonna get so hard once you see everything I've done. I probably So don't will. look, don't look, don't look Already until I won't. I won't. I'm still speedrunning. Speaking you of that, know. I got two rainbow splits. Oh! Cap oh, cascade. Oh, look at all little glowy and um, boo boo and woo 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 woo. Yeah. Okay, so technically the good dinosaur takes place first. And technically, Brave takes place in the 10th century, but it also comes back in the 5000s um, because of the witch is. Okay. I'm gonna. The I'll, witch, I'll, bring this, okay. I'll, I'll make this stream alive when I'm okay. done. The witch, the witch in Brave is Boo from Monsters Inc. What? And she's trying to bring back Sully. And so she what? the magic of the to go into the 10th century because that's where the magic is the strongest, so that she could bring back Sully. Uh, oh, whoa. Yeah. That is whack. The Pixar, the Pixar theory is really whack. So, yeah, um... And then um, there's The Incredibles, which happens, and takes place within the Pixar universe. And um, the the events of The Incredibles leads to the beginnings of By and Large Company, which is a very important thing in the Pixar universe, all right? Okay. I'm and then getting we have some the events of Toy Story. Lore. <laughs> uh -huh. And then we have the events of Toy Story, which the events themselves aren't very important to the Pixar universe, but it's rather the ideas and concepts that they add, right? Yeah. And then there's Finding Nemo and Finding Dory, which take place very closely to each other, just a year apart. What years, um, though? Which, 2003 and 2004. Wait, that early? Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> and then 2007 is Ratatouille. Ratatouille takes again, place just... in 2007? Yes. Are you sure um, that's so real? Finding Nemo and Finding Dory, along with Ratatouille and Toy Story and stuff, are just introducing concepts to yeah. the Pixar theory. Yeah. Um, and then there's Toy Story 3, which takes place also in 2007, shortly after Ratatouille. And then there's. And this is uh, Toy Story 3, you said? Yes. And then oh, there's yeah. Up, that takes place in 2007 as well. Jeez, 2007's a big Pixar year. Yeah, it was. Um. And Up actually, like, has a lot more lore for the Pixar theory than you would have expected. Whoa, um, really? I thought it would just be a story. Well, it's about Ellie. Oh. And how um, Carl, or whatever the heck his name is, um, Mr. Mr. Guy, the old man, <laughs> the, old the main guy. character... The main character, who is an old guy, his uh, yeah, yeah, it, it's talking about how um, Ellie, like his wife or whatever, yeah. is related to everyone in the Pixar theory. What? <laughs> yeah. How did they come up with this? I have to know. <laughs> um, I can send you the Super Carlin Brothers playlist. I want to be up till like four a.m. to. And I'm gonna be up here with you. Actually, speaking of which, I have to go to bed. So. Oh, good, good night. Good night. Bye. See you tomorrow. Right. Yep. See you tomorrow. Bye bye. For Carlin Brothers. Okay. I'm going to no! Go to the Hi. I've been born. Who has summoned me here? Who has thrown me into the abyss? Potato chip left. Oh. Okay. I'm dead. <laughs> okay. Um. <laughs> Okay, there are 16 videos about Pixar theory. Whoa. I, I, I don't even know if I can count that high. I can try, but I mean... <laughs> I can count that high on one hand. Wait, what? <laughs> okay, there's the playlist. You know, there's a lot of implications to that statement you just made. 
What kind of shape do you want? Do you want something that looks gooey? Do you want like a... Do you want like a raindrop? Do you want a star? Do you want a hexagon? Do you want a triangle? Um, what is this I shape for? Make it a dodeca. picture. I'm making it super minimalistic. Oh. Uh, which is really funny because dodeca. everything else is like hand drawn by a five year old. I said make it a dodeca. That's minimalist right there. You want me to make it look like I made it out of crayons? <laughs> yes. Make it a yes, yes, sir. I guess, I guess I won't use my custom profile logo maker i'll just go on to my art software and draw with my mouse no even better get a piece of paper and some crayons and do it yourself take and then just take a picture of i don't have crayons you don't have crayons i don't own crayons um, dang I'll, use, I'll use the crayon tool on digital oh. art I and i'll like just a... i'll just i'll just copy and paste like a piece of paper image on the <laughs> background Get an old piece of paper so it looks like, like this was drawn it. sometime in the 1700s. <laughs> yes, sir. Oh my gosh, I've never seen this Pixar Theory video. Do you want it um, to say, like, not fine o server, or do you want it just a crappily drawn picture of you? Have it say not fine o server, that, that's clever. I'm gonna make some- I'm gonna make it look like a five-year-old did it, though. Okay. Yes. Cause All right, are you- me. Are you doing your speed run still? Yes. I'm in I'm in Lost right. Kingdom right now. Oh wow. That was fast. Yeah, I'm at thirty forty two right now. I'm halfway through Lost. Wow. So it's not was, like, mega speed, fast. but it's not you hard. You did that really fast. Yeah. I got two rainbows and splits, which definitely shot me up a hair. Hmm. Though I don't think any of my Rainbow. other split times have been horrible. They've all just been pretty average. So hopefully I should as long as this run doesn't massively fail soon, like have some horrible you end of the world. Run. How many moons do you need? Uh, the minimum amount to beat the game. And how much is that? I don't know. Do the math. Google it. Uh, I just follow the route, okay? I don't count. I can't count that high, alright? I stop after 8. It's about where I'm comfortable. That's my comfort zone. Alright. Is that 6? Does that mean 2 more moons? Close. Yep, my <laughs> current, I gotta get the one under. I'm missing one, I'm missing one, I'm missing one, I'm missing one, I'm missing one. Oh wait, I know what I'm missing, and I know why I'm missing it too. Good thing I caught it quick. <sighs> what? So you would've... Got some time. Yeah. So I'm losing some minor time, but it's not major. Though luckily, that the bird cutscene, although it lost me time, saved me a little bit, because otherwise I would have died to the poison because I flew to jump, but it hit. It barely hit the the bird steal my hat trigger. So You've then got one more left to do. It's the one in the yep. cage, right? Nope. Under the bridge. Oh, all right. Because when we, then we just die f in the chat for our for our poor boy <laughs> <laughs> mario oh, died gosh. rip mario mario dies in the game and then he dies in real life a very efficient strategy mm -hmm. all right i have to collect a lot of coins in metro kingdom because part of the route for snow involves buying a moon, and if I'm short on coins like I was last time, I'll be boogered. Skipping cutscenes, am I right? Yeah. You, know, you can technically get it faster by counting a rhythm to it, but I am too lazy, so I just smash the plush button. Like Lunch. a the plunge button. <laughs> yeah. I want Keegan to get some, I need- we need to buy Keegan crayons. I yeah, think they should be- that, Should I make a donation goal for the stream and it's just buy Keegan yes. crayons? Yes. <laughs> I'll start it tomorrow, I'll have a donation goal and it's just <laughs> buy Keegan crayons. One of the donations is the crayons. <laughs> I'd love to see someone just like, I'll open a P.O. box and I'll just get like 80 box of crayons. 
I'll wait, I and hopefully I'll grow to like to a mega big streamer. So then when I when I make Pokemon look like a a guy with one follower. A guy with one follower. Yes, emphasis on guy. Pokemon <laughs> is a guy now. <laughs> yep. Always she always was. <laughs> yeah. And no, I won't let you bring up the contradictory statements in that sentence. <laughs> yeah, exactly. She was always a guy. She was, though. And I'm tired of people thinking she wasn't. She only changed last minute to get extra Twitch clout. What did you just do? <laughs> Speedrun oh strats. You got a moon! I did. It's not every... What was that? What was... What just happened? What was that? What was what? What just happened? Fell. Oh. No, but I literally, like... I bonked an invisible ceiling. I'm losing some time. But you know what? I've had a pretty decent run, so I'm just gonna keep it going, because it's not that bad of time loss. It sucks, but it's not the end of the world, hopefully. 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 It is. Hopefully. It really sucked if it was. It is? Ah, oh, darn. Well, uh, guess the stream ends here. <laughs> That's it, folks. Hey, hey, before the world ends, anyone wanna uh, drop me a PayPal donation? Anyone, uh, anyone wanna donate some crayons before the world ends? <laughs> yeah, we need to get Keek and Crayon before the apocalypse comes. <laughs> so that way when, he, when he's, like, in a bunker, all sad and alone, he can draw with his crayons. Yeah. He could draw me that logo he always wanted to make for my Discord server. For the world ends, wanna yeah. I can just imagine him like in a like in a bunker and it's like the middle of the zombie apocalypse and he's just like doodling with crayons like oh this would look so nice on his Discord server. <laughs> <laughs> if only the world didn't end. Could have could have had a nice Discord server. So okay. he talked about currency and I'm scared that currency and Discord server were in the same sentence. I don't know so what it's it can okay. mean, but I don't like it. It's scaring me. I'm worried he has a gun. I have a scab. <laughs> Close. You I want to know what the scab is? I've never heard of a scab, but we can always try it. <laughs> what? So I've never knew you had a scab, but I can, I can always give it a whirl. <laughs> Wait. You heard me. <laughs> I'm sorry, what? I know you heard me, I'm trying to hide. So much damage. I'm trying to collect coins. I need to make sure I have enough for Snow Kingdom. So I'm you taking- I'm going a little slower, but I'm making sure I get coins. Willing to try a scab. It's been a long time since I've done one, but I can always give it a whirl, I mean. I'm sorry. I, what? I, I'm not my young self anymore, but I can give it a try. Scabs aren't a drug. <laughs> yeah, they are. They feel no, like it. Not. They feel I mean, like yes, it. picking at scabs is great, but like... It's an experience no. that not everyone gets yeah, to picking have. Picking at scabs is a... Picking scabs is an experience. Some aren't even sure if it's real. But those people are just haters. <laughs> They're scab haters. Scout TF2. Scout from TF2? From TF2? I have, a, I have a friend who looks exactly like Scout from TF2. Did he cosplay as Scout from TF2 for Halloween any year ever? No, because he doesn't know what TF2 is. Make him change. I can just imagine you like having him at gunpoint, like you have a pistol to his head and he's just like, play TF2. <laughs> What have you done with my family? That's irrelevant. How did I make a five-year-old drawing look good? <laughs> the power of God in anime. What the fuck? Am I like, do I have gods like Geth? Yes. I yes, showed it to you, but I want to do it for the grand finale. Oh, yeah, I get it, I get it. 
You gotta get. You do, gotta, you, do, you, do you just want it to say like not fino server, or do you want it to be like have a, a picture on it? Can I see it? I mean, Jay can. You can as long as you don't spoil it. I will. I'll let him see it. I can't see it. I'm speedrunning. I'm trying to get a decent time. I'm, I'm gonna lower my PP. As long as nothing horribly ruins my run. Though I did have to slow down a little bit to collect some coins so I'd have enough for snow, because it'd suck if I had what happened last time and I ran out of coins. Grand moon. Yeah, it's not called like a multi moon, it's called a grand moon in Jap Japan Japan language. Japani. <laughs> yeah. Japanese! <gasps> <laughs> is that really the song that fits? The moon. <laughs> yeah. Why is the moon a moon? Why is the moon looking Because at? stars are for casuals. Wait, actually, you know what? Technically, the moon is in the moon. Like, I'm not joking. It's technically your mom? Whoa. I just got, technically, I just got wrecked. Okay, I'd like to inform you with the fact that technically the moon is actually a double planet i mean a planet it's a planet a double planet <laughs> yeah earth, earth is a double planet. There's two earth, of is them? A, earth is a double planet whoa that's some news we, right there we're we're a double planet with the moon with the moon we are a binary planet system that's the whack. moon is a the moon is a dwarf planet all right Oh, okay. I mean, the moon's just too big in relation to the Earth to be called a moon. Okay, I'll, I'll buy it. I'll buy it. I'm not even. I'm not even joking. Like the Earth is actually classified as a double planet. Wow, we live on a double planet. How humans are chads. All humans know, are chads, right? unless they li unless they're in space right now. In that case, they're not because they're not on the double planet. Okay, Jay, I'm gonna right. DM you this, and I want uh, you to. Give your honest opinion. Hell yeah, slide into my DMs. Always, baby girl. Uh, I was expecting that. Doesn't it look like a five-year-old did it? But it's beautiful. Dude, is, is it too minimalistic? Does it need more? I almost made a no, messed up it, comment it, by it accident. It doesn't need any more. It's perfect. It's absolutely perfect. Also, the word fine used to be a little bit more lopsided, but I kind of rotated it. You it rotated be... the fine. It also looked like... It, it originally looked like this. Here, I'll send you a screenshot of the original. Uh, the anticipation of getting to see the reveal. So, the fine used to be more lopsided. <laughs> lopsided. Yeah. But I think I like the straighter one more. Alright. No That's... offense, get it? But I'm... Yeah, I get it. Am I funny? Do you yes, no. me now? Everyone in chat laugh. I want to. I want to see everyone laugh in chat now or laughing. Die. You guys will literally explode if you don't laugh. They're not laughing. They're not uh, laughing. Uh, They're uh, not. They all uh, 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 uh. How do you have six do you, viewers right now? Who do you are think those that's six viewers? Jay, Jay, do you think that's acceptable, I mean, though? I'm thankful for him, don't get me wrong. But yeah. yeah, I'm thankful for them, but, like, who the hell are you? <laughs> Why would you even be here? Do yeah. you think that's acceptable, Jay? That is beautifully acceptable. I don't- it doesn't need anything else? It doesn't need anything else. <sighs> beautifully gonna... acceptable sounds Jay... almost like an insult. Jay, do you want to, like have an invite to the server it's not completely done but it's like what role is he gonna to... have what what role is he gonna get just jay. member i could uh, give him a custom one but it's, yeah, called, his role should just be homie. jay the, <laughs> bottom just text jay. just jay yeah. but like just the letter just jay and that's his whole role yeah, <laughs> just the letter <laughs> I'm a little pissed, baby. Yeah, you are, but it's okay, we forgive you. Well, you said being a pissed baby was a bad thing. I'm gonna make we still an forgive invite. you. I'm gonna make an invite I'm... link that only I have access to. Why? <laughs> so that people- uh, I made it so that members can't create invite links. So that oh yeah, that's don't... pretty standard. I was just like, I can't even have my own invite link. 
Because you can't join unless you actually, like, watch the stream or are part of YouTube or friends. There yeah. you go. Yeah, no, I get it. Not letting just members create Look, look what it says in the welcome chat, Jay. How do you feel about that? The welcome chat. I'm dying in anticipation it's to see this welcome chat. Final. Oh, that's beautiful. Don't read anything out loud because he's not supposed to know. What color do you want your special role? I want it... Um, uh, he wants I want, it in the go. I want it pink. I want it pink. You want it pink? I want it pink. Okay, baby girl, don't worry. Thanks, Dad. You're... You're gonna suffer. <laughs> there you go. Now, watch this. Look at... <laughs> wow. I'm trademarked. Also, uh... Jacob, you accidentally made it so that Gagober Nugget displays above the owner role, which is dad. <laughs> the owner role of the server is called dad. Yeah. And Gagober Nugget is like above dad, apparently. Yes. So <laughs> technically, like, according to the player list, like the ember list, I'm like better than you. You should fix that so that it's dad and then son. <laughs> or do you want it to be dad and then Gagober Nugget? <laughs> dad and then Gagober Nugget. <laughs> you spelled you spelled Gagober wrong too. You spelled Gaga Bober. <laughs> Gaga Bober. <laughs> so you might want to. I spelled Gagober wrong. <laughs> Why would that be hard to spell? Jay, do you want to watch me create the currency? There's gonna be a currency. There's no oh, yeah, geez. Gagober Nugget. <laughs> it's either that or Dino Nuggies. <laughs> Tyson Dinosaur Nuggets. <laughs> Gagober Dino, Dino Nuggies. nuggies. <laughs> Gagober Flip Flops. There's a, there's, a, there's a bot that adds a whole store system and stuff where you can yeah. earn, earn money. And then you could go to the in-game, like the in-server store and buy items that you can use that give you like effects and rolls. Yeah. So I can make an I can make an alcohol item for like ten gagobers. Gagobers. <laughs> and if you drink the alcohol, you get custom access to the drunk chat, and you just oh. you just be re you just be brain dead there. That would be a that would be a boggers moment. So I could I, I basically have infinite. It, this is using oh some gosh, the Captain Toad. Bot, yeah. The unbelieve a boat bot, and I'm super experienced with it. So. Cool. Cool. I'm hyped to see yeah, where it goes. You have a good run. You're already on Snow Kingdom, and look at your time. I'm definitely doing better. I know, right? Your time is if, so If you good keep up time. this pace, you'll do better than your last run. Yeah. Can we I get around with the vlogs, people who aren't even watching? We've almost been here for like three hours. Yeah. Once it turns to 1 a.m., I'm going to have to be a little bit quieter. But, like, yeah. no bedtime for me, because I don't like sleeping. Yeah. Well, I mean, we still got to research 321 Penguins lore. <laughs> yeah, we do. I would say the only thing to keep in mind, Keegan, is that uh, we do have a stream tomorrow at like twelve thirty, so just make sure you're there. And then um, so as well, long as you're I, awake uh, Jacob, and ready to play Skullgirls by then, then Jacob, yes. Yeah. Once you're once you're done with this speed run, are you gonna watch the Pixar theory videos? I may. If not, I'll watch them in bed. Are you gonna? You should watch them on stream. Cause Cause I Tim did, though. I'm worried I'll get copyright them. claimed. Oh no, yeah. You don't have to watch them on the stream. Writing. You don't have yeah. to watch it on the stream, but like, at least watch it in the call. I thought about it, or I'd watch them in bed tonight and I'd just discuss them tomorrow. I'd give That's my critical perfect. analysis. Ooh, that, you got stuck on that for a second. Detroit I know, that was an intentional building. setup. Uh, yeah, intentional. That's what they all say. No, really, that's the intentional setup if you uh, don't get the, like, fast strat with the staircase that gets, like, blown around. Then that's, like, the fast strats. So we use that. That's what they all Taking say. Control of them. That's what Amelia Earhart said when she was flying over that one ocean. 
That one ocean. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever one she was over or something. I don't know. <laughs> that one ocean. Ocean. Yeah. Maybe it was a lake or something. I don't remember. <laughs> one of maybe those lakes a, or oceans. Or... I don't know. She did something with water, I guess. <laughs> Imagine died. having your whole plane sink into she a sunk. puddle. She did, she, she did do something with water. You're right. She sunk into it and died. <laughs> yeah. I, it's something That's something. Like that, probably. That I don't is know. something with water. Maybe. I guess. Amelia Earhart. I guess that's possible. Wait, crap, I'm I don't not, have enough coins, dang. I'm not, I'm not god or anything, but I, right. that could have happened or something. Okay. Maybe. I'm worried I might lose time on this run Wait, ever so slightly. Wait, you're telling me you're not she, god. She, she should have changed her name to like, Amelia, Amelia Sniff Fart or something. <laughs> Rick. <laughs> what do you think she'd think of that if she heard that now? She'd think it was very gamer. She wouldn't even know the term gamer. <laughs> I mean, just think about it. She's kind of like old. Rats. Back in her day, they didn't have those beeping lights. I will never sleep naked again because of that one time I woke up to a rat in my ass. Whoa. Oh. All the way in. Like, Whoa. The tail All the way was in. Out just a little. Oh, God. Is that how you were able to get it out? I didn't get it out. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> and I haven't seen it since. I'm assuming my body slowly absorbed yeah, it. You're hoping it was digested? Sometimes when I go to the bathroom, I see a little bit of bones coming out. Then hopefully it was digested. Yeah, I think it was. Just, it went from the wrong end. Oh. You just ate a rat through your ass. I think I did. I mean, I, I named him Ross, and then he Ross. Died. Like I used to hear him squeak, and he stopped after like a few hours. <laughs> a few hours. Yeah, it, it's really tight in there, you know. Yeah, just the way you described it, though. Like I used to hear it for like a few hours. Yeah. Like you set, like you set it up, like you're gonna be like for a few months, but then it just went silent all of a sudden. Well, no, like. There's no air in there, so yeah. like. <laughs> what do you mean there's no air in your body? Well, no, not down there. <laughs> there's typically air. Not I, not where he was. <laughs> oh, where it is was, that? Most of your too, body it, has air. It was, it was too <laughs> enclosed, you know? Yeah. It, there's not much else to put there, so it just kind of goes, it, ugh, it, air well, works. It wasn't, it wasn't really the air that was the issue, it was just it was so tight that he, like, kind of got smushed, you know? Like he got suffocated? Yeah, so I had a bur b b burial for him, but the only way to bury him was go potty in his grave. So, <laughs> so you I was crapped a on a man. You you crapped on a like man's over, grave. I, I had a bowel movement, and there was a little jaw coming out. So I was like, oh, I guess I should go put this in a grave. So I like <laughs> finish in a hole, and I put a little tombstone on it. And How I said, honorable it, of you! I, I said, may he rest in shit. Because he, he was. How honorable. He, he was resting in mine, so. Rest in violence. Rest in doo doo. What? Rest in poo poo. It's oh, got him. Rest in violence. R.I.V. My hand is feeling tired, and now is not the time for my hand to feel tired. Baby, Where's I can get your hand active if you know what I'm saying. Just kidding. Oh, Die. Alright. Hey, gold split on snow. Or rainbow. Same thing. Are you gonna keep... Are you I gonna wanna... keep Jacob up all night? I, I'm playing on it. What should the symbol for Gagober money be? Um, it should Goobers, be... Goobers, the candy, the little, like, chocolate candies, that should be the symbol. It's just... Well, I need, I need an actual emoji. You can make your own emoji and then make that thing. Yeah. I don't think it. Oh. Yeah, just cut like do a poorly cut out PNG of it, <laughs> and that's a Gagober nugget. Or you know oh. those little like gold nugget candies, that you no. know there's a bunch of the little like rocks that like come in the little pouch or whatever. I Got googled a... Gagober, and it came up with an anime girl. With an <laughs> oh no, <laughs> and that works. From Sao. Oh, then it oh. no longer works. <laughs> 
I'm a goofy goober. I can make it the cool SpongeBob looking like. Yeah, the make it the like Rock peanut Star boy. Guy. In honor oh, of it, you being a goofy man. goober. I. Do you want the goofy goober? Peanut I'm a goofy boy? goober. Yes. If I you do. Exist, I do. In if fact, you exist. You're a goofy goober. I am a goofy goober. Now I gotta go. Photoshop this. Oh, you got your third rainbow? You're really, you're really yeah. putting me uh -huh. through a lot of work, huh? You're putting yeah. me through the motions. And putting me that, through anus. That he didn't even know existed, but they were emotions that did exist. I'm a goofy Gruger. Whoa, can you do that? Keegan no, has always had the ability to put me through the motions. Are you, is that bad? I think it is. It might That's be. That's up for debate. Yeah. Some are like, no, that's bad, you're an abusive husband. And others are like, no, it's fine. No one likes Wobbin anyways. Such a debate. This is a really unsettling Wait, movie. Wait, Keegan's my husband? Yeah. Uh, I'm married. I just kind of assume so. I mean, what else would he be? I'm everyone's husband, though. Like, I literally I, thought I would marry... I guess so. <laughs> you said you'd marry enough people in my Twitch chat that at this point, you're the entire Twitch chat's husband. That's just how it... I'm... That's my job, though. I had to. That's your job? Like, that's your employee title? I was getting proud to be your husband. To do it. Like, I can imagine you applying for your job, and on your resume you just have listed former Twitch chat husband. <laughs> Wow, Wait, you guys former. Know. There was a divorce. No, <laughs> maybe I don't remember. But like, what if when he wrote yeah. the um, resume, he like inf he like bolded the words "former," <laughs> <laughs> like emphasis on "former," Twitch chat husband. Th yeah, there was a there was a falling out, but we don't talk about that day. <laughs> yeah. No, let's talk about that. What, what happened? April third of twenty thirty. Twenty thirty. See, the world has gone to shit, and I'm the only survivor. <laughs> You're the only person maintaining Twitch servers. Because everyone, you are everyone, the husband. Everyone needs me. Yeah, of course. What you. else would they do? Everyone includes me, therefore I need you. you I already knew that, though. Yeah. That was pre-established. Can I just expose you, Jay, right now about me yeah. and you? About what you? Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, I, I'm pretty sure. I don't know if Jay actually said this or not, but I'm pretty sure he used to have a crush on me. Yeah, I did. Oh, poggers. And I mean, like, sadly, I'm sorry, Jay. I mean, it's not the end of the world, but like, sadly, I'm. I don't like you. No offense. I understand that. You're a pretty pogger person, just not dating wise, you know. Yeah. Sorry to crush your dreams, but there's other dudes out there. My my beans have not been crushed. Don't worry. That is very epic. That is not a, po a unpoggers moment. But yeah, that's it. That's that's the whole story. That's literally that's the story. it. And now I'm making the gagober. Give my life. You have to tell me if this is good or not, though, Jay. I'll say what? Jay has to do it because I I'm I'm speed running. I don't have time for your shenanigans, your mom. I'm speed running. <laughs> the image is literally called Gagober. Gagober. <laughs> Smooth. The suspense is killing me, though. Okay, go to general, and then just do the uh, two <laughs> dots, and then Gagober, and then the two dots. <laughs> Emoji. <laughs> that is the Gagober money. <laughs> Funny. <laughs> what is this good uh, money is, I'm hearing about? That is not the currency. <laughs> yes. Wait. So watch, 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 watch. Um. How much money should people start off with when they join the server? One. Sixty-nine gigobers. Sixty-nine gigobers. <laughs> Wait, what is the pro <laughs> of Gagober Nuggets? Look, 69 Gagobers! Look at that! Is the, is the plural of Gagober Nugget Gagobers? Gagobers, yeah. yeah. Is the general chat just gonna be all Gagobers? Yeah, it is. Is it Gagober Pog? Yeah. Or is it just Gagober? Because it kind of looks like a Gagober Pog. Yo, oh, Randall on Seaside. 
and oh, Rainbow yeah. Seaside. Wow. Holy shit. You never get Rainbow Seaside. Su su Though I su never make it to Seaside, so... I'm really oh impressed gosh. with your time right now. Thank you. You got four rainbows. Yeah. This Next is Lunch On, though, and Lunch On could be a run killer. Yeah. Just because I'm I bad remember, at Lunch On. I remember seeing you do Lunch On, and it was just suffering. Yeah. I'm good. Yeah. It's the though, new Eevee yeah. Lucian. Though I do more, know more of the route a little better now, though, so it shouldn't be as what, bad. What, Keeg? Oh, I was going to say, uh, actually, never mind. That'll be not necessary. Say it. That'll be on the next oh, episode. I was just going to say, like... Uh, your your role, your custom role, JTM, J trademarked. Uh, doesn't have any like admin or anything. It's just there. I know. You're you're just acknowledged as J. Yeah. Announcements one has been archived. What has been archived? Announcements one. There's announcements one. Where is it? Where In the other server. server. Oh, I thought you were talking about this server, and I was like, excuse me. I was like, geez, you've already <laughs> archived a channel, and we haven't even had any, like, members yet. <laughs> yeah, it's basically... Uh, okay, let, let me say pre-archived it. 36 players are to be incinerated. Oh, okay, I'm sorry. I'll get incinerated, I guess. Hey, That's um, what happens when you try to get Cobra get... Nugget. Yes. I have access to announcements... <laughs> I'm turning that off. Can I put a <laughs> can I put a gagober there first? Yeah, you can add everyone and just put a gagober. No one's in the server though, so it won't add anyone. So but... I'm gonna get a Discord ping with just gagober. <laughs> it's just gagober. I haven't like mute most of my s I haven't done it to this server yet, because you know I created it so quickly. But uh, most of my servers I have set to like only like give me notifications when like pinks including at everyone pink Jay, that's why can you, like can you send anything anymore no is it just for looking yeah can you react with a gagober does it let you <laughs> um it, it does let me add gagober, react, yes. react with a gagober please thank you that's can all we don't even say gagober just see it <laughs> acknowledge the gagobers <laughs> This is so good. I'm so proud of my work. Doesn't it actually look decent, though? It does. Can't believe our entire Goober currency is, so is formed off the fact I spelled goober wrong. <laughs> you tried calling me like a goober nugget, and it, he was like, "Hey, get in the stream call. We're gonna, I'm, I'm gonna stream soon." And he, he called. He was trying to insult me, and he spelled it like, "I'll look at it." Okay, so. <laughs> On March 5th, 2021, he said to me, exactly, Hey, Gagober Nugget, get your sexy ass, no homo, over here. He spelt here wrong. I missed a call from him, and then I called him, because I missed it. And we, and that's when I joined the stream. So, All right. if you want to know wh why Gagober Nugget is, it's because I'm Gagober Nugget. <laughs> And he doesn't know how to English Goober. <laughs> Does that mean our the server currency is themed off of you? You are. Th is that why you're the currency master? Is because the currency is you? Yeah. Yeah, he's yeah, the currency. No. I didn't really think of that. I mean, that's just how valuable he is. You're kind of you're actually bombing luncheon really well. It's not yeah, working. It's not too bad. Better than not previous though. <clears throat> yeah. That, though I though I did screw up. I just... did yeah. I did screw up the like triple jump at the beginning though. It took me an extra like three attempts. Yeah. Um, Metro lost cloud wooden and lake and stuff. I'm sure you can get good little, time here. Little behind. Like uh, I thought you would have gotten a decent wooded one. Wooded kingdom. I thought you finally mastered it. I've gotten better, but I've still got to practice some more. I just didn't get in some pra as much practice for it as I would have liked. Yeah. But it's okay, it's still better times than your original, like, beginner Yeah. Stuff. Did you know that someone found a speedrun route that involves completely skipping, uh, the Brutal? The Golden But radish. it's hard. It's hard. Like, if you want to actually make it a speedrun route that would save time, you have to be one of the, like, highest level runners. Like, I will probably never use the route. They don't recommend it. Not unless it, you get really good. No, even then, because it's... It, it, 
Yeah. It doesn't save really much of any time, but it's super difficult, so... It was more of a proof of concept than, like, a new route to use. It was more of just, let's see if it's possible. If it could be done. And then they just moved on. Yeah. So many places you got a ground pound to get moons. Yeah. Well, it's not that hard, because they're easy to notice. Yeah. They emit particles. Oh, alright. Also, I played uh, Mario Odyssey on a normal, like, just casual, and it was the best experience of my whole fucking life. I can say 100% that my most favorite video game out of all times is uh, Mario Odyssey. Hmm. Fair enough, fair enough. Mine would have to be... Um... It's a tie between Hollow Knight and uh, Monster Hunter World. Oh, Monster Hunter is actually really fun. I've personally never, like, gamered it, but... Yeah, I've never really gotten into Monster Hunter. I've gotten um, to play it at Andrew's house once. Yeah. He's, he's um, very stingy World... when it comes to video games, by the way. Yeah. Andrew. Um, World is, I'm going to have to say, so far the best Monster Hunter game. Yeah. I played the Rise demo. And I played yeah, when Rise... everyone was on the Wii for like a whopping half an hour eight years ago. Rise is gonna be absolutely great from what I've seen. Okay, what was your guys' favorite Wii game? Not Wii Ooh. or anything, just Wii. It's tied That's between Mario cool. Kart Wii and uh, Super Mario Galaxy 2. I'm gonna it's have just, to say Super Mario between... Galaxy. Galaxy oh, 1 or 2. First, it's one a tie between um, the first Skylanders game Oh and, god, don't uh, even get me started, man. Dude. And um, I actually started with Swap Force to be honest. Oh wow. Really? What a what a what a un good gober. Um, that, that's a little disappointing actually. It is. And um and my and it's and then what it's tied with is so weird. It's the uh 007 Wii game. I have actually never heard of that or played it. I've heard it's of it, but I never had a chance like, to play it. It's a first-person shooter yeah, for the Wii. Yeah, it's a 007 game. Yeah. I think there was this Wii game that was multiplayer that I always played with my si siblings, and they ref they refused to play with me because I was so good at it, and I was like the youngest child back then. Red <laughs> Steel. Red Steel. My what god. Red Steel. So basically, it's a first-person yeah. shooter yeah. video game. Yeah, I know. I don't know what Red Steel is. That's but why I was just like, hold on, really? The, the campaign is you just, like, run around and, you know, like, it's kind of like Yakuza, but we and you kill people and stuff, and it's not Japanese. Yeah, I've been really wanting to get into Yakuza. But the thing is, there was a multiplayer mode mm -hmm. that me and my siblings would do, and you're basically in a big arena. Yeah. There's It's split screen, but you're first yeah. person. So your Wii remote is like a katana, and you're and you can aim with a gun and shit when you swap out. So it is like hyper um, realistic, like amazing controls. And, that's wacky. And you could go up to one of your siblings and just shank them, and it was the best experience ever because you'd run around like an arcade that's abandoned and like on Wii and just shoot your family, and it was funny and epic. So my favorite Wii U game might have to go to Wind Waker HD, just because it's my favorite Zelda game. I favorite Wii U game I've never, would have to go to Mario Party. I've never owned a Wii U, but uh, I had a chance to, and I said no. I don't. I, I freaking love yeah. Mario. Yeah. I was an early adopter, and I love that thing. I miss my Wii U so much. I, mean, I, I think, never had a Wii U. I think I mean, actually, I think at some is. point I did get a Wii U, but I uh, sold it because I just really wasn't a huge fan. Yeah, I uh, loved my I, Wii U, man. I, they're so nice. Uh, the best games that I remember playing on it were that one Paper Mario game that came out just for the Wii U. Uh, that being Color Splash. Color Splash, yeah. Uh, also, what was it called? Splatoon. Splatoon was. Uh, Splatoon hard. One, man. I had like hundreds of hours in that. That was so. Fun. I was garbage, and I didn't actually own it. I had to go to Andrew's house and mooch off of him to play it. Oh yeah, I <laughs> owned it, man. I, I remember like picking up a copy and on the ride home just like staring at the back of the box just like everyone oh, it. Andrew. seriously the thing is whenever i hang out with andrew i'm like hey let's play video games together and like we do it but the thing is yeah, whenever i was like i've been to his house a few times um, when i went to andrew's house mm -hmm. we uh we played west of loathing and it was so great well yeah the thing is sometimes it can be fun but whenever i play video games with andrew like at his house he doesn't let me play them he lets me watch him play video games 
Thank you. Oh yeah, that's how it was. And, I, and I'm like, they didn't because it was absolutely I, re- great. I really like in I I really enjoy watching you play Pony Town, or whatever it's called, the one where it's all corrupted and stuff. Yeah, it's it's Pony, Pony Island. Island. Pony Island. Yeah. yeah, close enough. I literally watched. Yeah, he him streamed play. that for me. It was it was at, weird. I was at his house and we spent like half the time I was over there for a sleepover just watching him play, and Dude. it was pretty epic because he was good at it. But I was like. Can we play something together? You know, like a yeah. multiplayer game? And he was oh. like, no. Also, so. Uh, he's gotten better about that because when I went, we played Smash and stuff. But yeah, he can be oh, better. That's good. I, also, yeah. I really want to I got a Smash very much rainbow time. split on lunch on. You know what sucks is um, when I. Since I moved, I haven't, like, kept my friends or made friends with the new people. So, like, Jacob. You're friends mm-hmm. with Andrew. Yep. If I didn't move, we probably would have been friends. Because I, I was, like, the starter of the friend group. I was the one that, like, shoved Andrew and Tristan together and me. Uh, I was, like, the, I guess, the glue. You know, I started mm-hmm. it. Which sucks, because, you know, I started the friend group, and then I moved. So, yeah. like, I'm that's not... How, that's how it was with me in Nebraska. I yeah, was the so thing, in Nebraska, so it and like, when I moved here, and, like, everyone just fell apart. Literally, the only two people left were, uh, there, there were only two people left of, like, six overall members of the friend group. Uh-huh. And it's just sad. I mean, I still stay in contact with them all the time. Uh-huh. Talk to them on, like, a daily basis. What, what's really upsetting me, though, is I don't have a lot of friends where I moved to. It's kind of lonely here. And seeing all of my old friends from my old school, like, getting even more friends, like you, Jacob, and mm-hmm. Jay as well, it kind of sucks. Because I'm over here like, I would have been able to be a part of you guys yeah. if I didn't move. And I yeah. moved against my will. See, I, I probably... Where did that dragon like, come from? Me off. I'm just so upset. Who knows, man? Yeah, I, could... I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if I'm just like greedy or anything, but I feel no, like I, I deserve to like be a part of you guys and stuff. Mm. I can definitely see. It'd be taken out so out of context. Mmm, gay. It just kind of makes me upset because I'm like, why did I have to move? You guys are poggers. I've been yeah. to Jay's house actually, which was yeah, very yeah. epic. That was actually really fun. It was super awesome. Didn't like, we watch Groundhog Day? <laughs> <laughs> we did. You fell asleep, though. The thing is, the thing is, what was the only reason why it was super awkward when me and Jay hung out for the first time is because we've only we only knew each other for like two weeks. Yeah. And then and then we were like, you know what? We're gonna hang out like right now. <laughs> and we yeah, did. That was and weird, it, it was, but it, it was happened. Fun. It was fun. Jay beat me up with a stick. That sounds like, like a, a very J thing to do. Or a stick, I forgot. You had two of them. It that was sounds like a, a very J thing to do. I get you had a sword, and then I. Oh, had you had it. You gave staff. me the flimsy stick. <laughs> what? I you know, that sounds I'm like a very J thing staff. to do. You took your dad's cardboard cutout. Wow. That sounds dad, like a wow. very J thing to do. Yeah. His um, dad like, had a cardboard I can cardboard. fully no, I'm believe much that. better with the staff now than I was with the sword. Are you practicing beating me again? Thanks. Awesome. I'm, He's I getting ready. every night, man. I can just imagine him, like, training away. Like, there's just <laughs> yeah. hours a day, and his parents are like, you need to take go to sleep. It's two in the morning. No. Training. I must get stronger. I must get stronger to defeat Kigar. <laughs> I already did defeat you, though. You did. You actually kind of hurt me. I cried. Hey, uh, you got rainbow time on luncheon? Yeah, not on Ruin, though. You just did yeah. watch in Rainbow? Oh, well, baby. I, I just finished Ruined. If you can rush Bowser and Moon, then... Yeah. Also, I actually know how to do uh, Caveless now on Moon, so that'll save me a lot of time. Oh, good. I'm not disappointed in you anymore. So, yeah, that was so sad good. that I couldn't do it, but I know how. Yeah, I had to watch you do Cave. And now I know remember. where to grab Moon, so that way I don't have to go backwards. Call and Bowser. It. Because that was also kind of embarrassing. Yeah, that was a little. Pain. So I, I definitely think I'm gonna get a much improved time. Ain't no world record pace. Hours. But yeah. yeah. The only reason I'm still going this late, honestly, is because um, 
Normally I'd have to call it because my mom wouldn't wipe me up, but my mom's out doing something. So. That's good. Since she's not here to want me to go to bed, it means I can do what I want. Yeah. Screw um, rules. Anyways, um, <laughs> Screw the rules. Yeah. And any other highlights of the sleepover? Um, when we played that card game, was it Magic that we played? Uh, yeah, we played Magic. I was garbage right. at it, and you, I had no clue what I was doing, but that was pretty funny. Nah. Uh, when I ate with your parents, though, when you when we had dinner, it was super awkward, because your parents kept asking me political stuff, and I was like, no. Yeah, <laughs> my parents tend to do that. Yeah, but the thing is, like, I don't know if you knew, but when parents ask their kids friends political stuff it's to determine whether or not they're a good yeah. friend so if my parents were like jay what's your political stance and you said something that they don't like like oh i'm this and they don't like whatever political stance you are they would be like don't hang out with jay anymore to me so mm -hmm. i was like i'm not political i don't mm, no please think i'm just no straight and not you should just gone all the way stupid and just been like what's a politic <laughs> who is who is a politic? Never heard Who's of him. Politic. Never heard of him. <laughs> Who's politic? Is he or something? Who's Mark? It it just kind of bothered me. It made me super uncomfortable. The food yeah. was good, but yeah, like the food was great. It just Say, made me like ooga booga. Yeah. Anytime people bring up politics with parents, other than it's that, the whole sleepover was pretty epic. Yeah. I thought it was actually pretty cool. I thought it would be a lot worse than it was actually, because you know. Really? What did you think would happen? I don't you would know, kill no, him in no, sleep. Nothing, nothing bad. I was just anxious because I have anxiety. Social anxiety. Extreme, by the way. I like, tried my best not to be awkward. But the thing is, it was extremely awkward. But it was still fun. Yeah. It's okay. Very epic. You were just like, I don't know who you are, but hi. <laughs> Me and Jabe actually played with Hot Wheels. I'm not even kidding. Yo, yeah, Hot Wheels are. Hot I, Wheels. I brought a Hot Wheel to a band I concert one time. Years, I, I'm 14 years old still, technically, unless you count a few days as me being 8, 15, but. I'm literally older than you. Yeah, me and Jay literally played with Hot Wheels. I actually brought a Hot Wheel to a band concert one time. And literally had it on my stand while I was playing, because I didn't have any music there, because I memorized all of it. So I was just like playing my part in the concert, and just. <laughs> I know everyone was laughing at me. Baseball actually kind of makes me want to go to a baseball game. Baseball? Yes. They game need to reenact. They, no, uh, they need to reenact baseball in real life. I'll do it. Yes, we are going to do that. I, I, think Jessica, we, I, 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 think I get a. I, I'm gonna be Jessica Telephone because she's right. she's a woman, and I think it would be funny to like have fake boobs. I'll be Chorby <laughs> Short. <laughs> what is that one tiger dude or whatever? I forgot what he's called. I forgot what team he's on too. But there's this tiger dude. There's a tiger dude. Some I only know the Yellowstone guy. Magic players. I think he. I, I only know the Brethmans. <laughs> we only know our teams. Um, well, I mean, I know some of the uh, Garages players, too. Ever, oh. I already know the Garages. Yo, I just Mainly because follow. they have a cat boy. Who's it from? Who's it from? David E. Bublo, 5. Yeah. Oh. Malik Destiny. Yeah, I'm not like, fine. Thanks for noticing. not fine? How, Malik that, Destiny. That, such a good player. Is that a compliment? I don't understand. My brain is... You don't remember what my username is, right? Yeah, I know. He's not fine. Are you just saying he isn't, or are you like... <laughs> Is there some kind of implications here? <laughs> I don't understand. But thank you for following. Yeah, I'm, for not, follow. I'm, not the one, I'm not the one streaming, but I talk yeah, a lot. So. I, I am the one. He's just... He's a personality here. Malik I Destiny am a like personality. personality. That's the nicest way to say I'm loud. Players. Players. I have a no, I mean, like, like TV personality. Like, you're the personality. Nine people in total on the stream. Can nice. Can you get a round nice. of applause in the chat, please? Oh, right. yeah, let's David go. David E. I don't know how to say your name, but I'll try. David, David E. Bubolo 5. <laughs> it's literally just David Bubolo 5. It's the closest I can get. So sorry if I butchered that, but regardless. You sound like you're about to ASMR. I'm glad. Not me, obviously. He is. He does sound like he ASMRs. Yeah. I don't, though, to be honest. 
Call or me David. No. All right, I got David, you, David. Can I call you Dad? Cause you 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 followed, and that deserves my love. Anyone that follows David Ebola gains five. my love. By the way, we are the tribune. Wait, 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 wait. So, so he said um, okay. <laughs> wait, no. In, in the Discord server. In the Discord server, if, uh, no, if sure. was, that's not done yet. If he's if he's dad and your son, does that make me the Holy Spirit? Yes. No, you're just Jay. <laughs> yeah, with a copyright. You're, you're a trademark. Yeah, you're you're like the company's trademark. <laughs> no one can use the letter I, J in all I, the Can I be states. your mascot? Yes. I'm the mascot. What are you talking about? Oh, you're right. No, you're the you're, current. You're the no. I've been the mascot. We've actually talked about this in the oh. past streams. Um, you're the Wyatt Glover of the Discord server. You no, are the economy. I I am. You I'm are the, the I am the server. I'm the living, breathing embodiment of the server. All right. Um, you are the trademark. You are you the business-related uh, stuff. You want to hear my top? Gotta buy a truck and a pack of beer. Players. Honestly, that that's that's yeah. Do it. I don't blame you. Okay. My top three blaze ball players. Number one. What kind of beer Glover. though? I need I need to know what kind of beer. Cause if it's a bad beer, then I'm disappointed in you. So Number I need to know two, what type. Malik Destiny. Malik Destiny needs to get stomped on. Die. Number three. Peanut Bong. Peanut Bong is actually legendary. I like his name the yeah. most. Peanut um, Bong. Makes I guess music. I guess you know I'll give you number four, and it's Cas Fiasco. Cas. I actually don't know. He's in. Yet. He's in one of the new. He's in one of the four new teams. I've actually never heard of Heineken beer. Oh, actually, I I have heard of it. I just don't remember yeah. the name. Heineken, but I know yeah. exactly what it looks like. It's the the green like typical stuff. That stuff's actually okay. That's that's acceptable. If you were gonna say something like Bud Light or like something Corona. like that, I would have been really disappointed because that stuff's icky. You're right, bad. It's just you know. Ironic. No under, Can I get no, you banned on Twitch for saying uh, Corona? No underage drinking here. I'm, I'm definitely not a child, but yeah, I'm leaving it at that. Yep. I mean that sentence seems fair enough to me. You, know, you don't have man. Bud Light in Italy? Oh my God, you're in Italy? Round of applause. Yeah. Pizza pie. Hey. Are you aware that there is a wall clip glitch right there? Yes, I know. I'm just not going to try when you, it. When you wall right. clip in real life, get it? I'm going to no clip in, in real life and go to the back, ro and oh, go that's to the right. back rooms. So Italy apparently has some standards. <laughs> that's bad. This is good. I don't know if this is... Yeah. This You're is native Italian. Very nice. Oh, wait. The Pokio did that thing again where it like gets stuck on the edge. I don't know why it does that. That ruins your whole run. I mean, it doesn't, but it's still annoying. Do you speak English? <laughs> Get it? Because he's literally talking to us in English. Alright. I'm funny. Mm -hmm. Laugh. Do Laugh not. right yeah. now. Go ha ha. Glad to see Italy has some standards in their beer. Should I try to go for the leg um, strap? I, I actually prefer like... So Keegan, who whiskey? are your top... Uh... I don't really like beer. Kobe. Who's my what? Who are your top uh, blaze ball <gasps> players? I just earned 500, 588 coins from 49 breath mint wins. I just Whoa. got. I, I barely lost. I haven't been on blaze ball recently, and I have 964 yeah. coins. Did you just get smushed by the Bowser box? Yeah, I did. The, it's it's the Mecha fun. Brutal, is its name. Zoomer humor. I'm, I'm, I'm actually not a Zoomer, fun fact. How so? so Thanks a lot. Uh, what are we? No, the definition of a zoomer does not fit me. Zoomers are born in a newer age, from around like people who are born in like the 2010s are zoomers. And since I wasn't born in the 2010s, I, I mean, no, zoomers are technically 2000s. See, I got crushed. Well, y well, yeah, but the. If the actual term is people who are younger than I am, so. And you're I'm, younger I'm than I am, so that means I'm fine. I'm legitimately not a Zoomer. It's and that, I'm not neither a am I. I, well, I. We're at the prime age. Everyone in this voice chat is at, like, middle 
of Zoomer and Boomer, so we're not yeah. either I'm yet. Boomer Millennial. Yeah, Millennial. Once, Boomers once are a distance. Once we get to full legal age, then we're legally like a Boomer. <laughs> once, you, once you become an adult, you're already an old person. Yeah, that's oh, just no. how it goes. Like, you literally um, just like, anyways, you turn 18 and bam. As I was asking... You just messed who, that up. You need to clutch I'm good. Dog. I got it. Yeah, Kognar, as I was asking, who are your top baseball players? What was that? Uh, I... Jessica, telephone, number one. Alright. That's okay. understandable. Mr. Daddy Peanut, you know? Oh, yeah, yeah. I got, I got it. It's... P Peanut Bong, you know, it's... Legally required. It's know? just one of those names. Uh, let's see, where's the... Support the body man. Yeah. Support so the I am... Man. Yeah, they're talking about Blazeball, whatever that is. Uh, yeah. yeah. Blazeball is great. You should do Blazeball. Uh, I also like pitching um, machines. So season 12 just ended. Season 13 should be yeah, I have no soon. idea what they're talking about either. I, I really like, I, I like pitching machines. <laughs> oh yeah, pitching machines. <laughs> so I am horribly butchering this guy. I have, I have, I have that crush, iconic I have, character. I have a crush on no, pitching no. machine. Yo, I just lost a lot of time because I was, I'm dying at the, I'm getting all oh, nervous and I'm killing the run. Why are you nervous? You, you're doing really well. Yeah, that's why I'm nervous. It's just unconsciously nervous, because I'm doing well. Where is he? God, my brain is not finding him. Where is he? I only know the team he is in. I don't remember his name. Whose name? Um, there's a character, there's a player in the Millennials called Thomas Drakena, and he oh, wields I... an actual airplane as his weapon. Yeah, which I think is epic. Yeah, he... I think yeah, I think I think her cool. name has like pasta in it. For, Lizzie Pasta from Core Mechanics. Oh, mm, pasta, pasta, pasta. Mm. Wait, Lizzie Pasta. Her, from and Core her Mechanics. her her blood type is H two O. She's literally yeah. water. You sports activity <laughs> and friends. I agree. Who? She's literally pasta. Why would you ever want to socialize or do sports or anything? Um, the only sports that matter are esports. I forgot. I I I forgot all the names. Technically, is esport. You know, because Blazeball hasn't been going for a while until recently, I kind of like lost it. You know. Whoa, that's a clutch. That's a clutch. Did you see that on the brutal? Yeah, pretty wacky. I actually don't like sports, but Blazeball is like funny sports. Yeah, Blazeball's I'm, cool. I'm, People I'm, get I'm burnt actually alive a... and put in peanuts. It's great. Ironically, I'm a programmer, which is like the opposite of someone who plays sports. Yeah. I stay yeah. inside all day. I'm not overweight. Technically, I'm underweight, actually. Not technically, like, definitely. But, I'm like, I rarely underweight. go outside, and I'm kinda unhealthy. But I, I program and stuff, and I'm really good at it. So but my mom just I, doesn't I, understand I'm gonna be a gamer. <laughs> I hate sports, but baseball is, like... Cool. It's different. It's, 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 it's a it's lifestyle. Just, it's just epic. I don't know how to yeah. describe it. It's like in another universe, you know? It's a, it is. It so is physics universe. aren't real there, you know? Oh, and um, EA Sports. EA Sports is a good sport. Sports Anything that EA Sports does is a real sport. I'm, 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 well, I'm, no. Baseball isn't a sport. It's a sport. It's a lifestyle. How old are you, Davey? David, unless you don't want to tell us. But if you're buying beer... I don't know if the drinking is it is is in Italy, honestly. <laughs> the Zinga. I'm, I I think it's lower than here. Oh, it probably is. We're one of the highest drinking ages. Which I hate. I want to like leave. Just for that reason. Yeah. Private yeah, age boy. Fair enough. Fair enough. He's also buying a truck and a pack of beer at the same time, are you going to drunk drive? Are you going to commit a man's vehicular manslaughter? <laughs> you better. <laughs> no. Do it, in, <laughs> Don't encourage do it in, it. in my name. That's my job, I'm supposed to. <laughs> so, Kagan, do you see that clutch on the second attempt at Mecha Brutal? Your mama. Do vehicular Brutal? manslaughter in my name. As long as I don't screw up the moon skip, because I do remember how to do it, then I just got to go finish the fight, and I'll have a... I'm not so great upset. run, but I'll still be pee. Who knows? I, yeah, that's fair really enough. Not Rainbow. Yeah. Yeah. I'm so upset 
that Kansas City breath mints is still on mild low. Uh, Yellowstone. I could is see getting too, into, into Blaze Ball just for having a team that's known as the Breath Mints. Uh, yeah, I'm in the Kansas City Breath Mints. And my favorite I, my favorite idol, like my favorite player is called Jessica Telephone. She has a telephone for a head. Okay. Uh there's I no just like to tell you. Art, everyone just assumes. I just like her, her, to tell you yeah. that um that Wyatt Glover gives five times the coin earnings. Wyatt Glover? Yeah. Go, go along. Yeah, Wyatt. Yeah. <laughs> That's Look beautiful. That. I, I literally that. get I literally that get four thousand coins to hit from him. That's a little OP. I know, right? Wyatt Glover is the economy. I, I'm kind of sad her blood type isn't telephone. It's just o, o, you know? Blood type O. Oh. And then every player on Magic, uh, blood type is oh no. God, Jessica Telephone's batting is, like, top tier. Yeah, Jessica Telephone's one of the best players. It's in like five and a half batting. Um, but, oh, I don't remember who the best player's name was. She's honey um, roasted. When did she get honey roasted? Um, back in season nine, um, there was a thing. So oh, you I remember was there. When they had to, How did I miss it? Um, you're no. You started in season eleven. Did I? No, no, no. Yeah, we did. I, I, I was around like the beginning. I was at the end of season nine. That's I, I was early on. Yeah. I introduced you to Blaze Ball, didn't I? Yeah, it was at the end of ninth though. No, I started yes, it was. at the beginning. Context, please. Look, no. I don't have context either. I'm pretty sure we started at the at the beginning of season eleven. Like Are you sure? Because sure. I don't remember I'm her sure. being honey roasted until just now. Honey, honey roasted. It's permanent. Um, she too, got dude. that. Yeah, it's permanent. She got it from being a part of the shelled ones pods in season nine at the boss fight yeah. with the peanut god. David, I wish I had context too. Uh, here, I'll send you guys a link. Just click it and everything will make sense. Everything. Okay. You might have to... Yeah. Alright, got me. Um, were you there for the Peanut God boss fight? Huh? Pe I've, 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 I've re-watched it on YouTube. Because someone, oh. like... Is Kansas City Brothman's playing right now? No. I'm so upset. I'm gonna cry. Um, no, because we just have the championships. Where? When are those again? Time I met Gay or James season, Charles Streamer. Season 12 is over. Nice. I don't know when the yeah. next season's gonna start. Um, I wish I could have met Gay or James Charles. I would have been honored. Go to election, it tells you basically when the next season starts. It just starts tomorrow. Well, yeah, I know. Purchase your voting rights. I guess I'll do that. Oh, yeah. You have the buy the right to vote. Based that's, how, that's how can real make, life should can be. Can I make Jessica Telephone based? Yeah. No, like, the term base, you know what it means, right? Yeah, I know what it means. I can organ replace Jessica Telephone. Yeah, that's pretty whack. No, actually, it's not for a single player. Oh yeah, it's three. Um, if you want to select a specific player, do oh, Wills. And then go to Infuse if you want to freaking do Let's go. Let's go. Get, get Will access. So we're I getting close to the end of the run. Okay, I'll I let you know to... when I get towards the end of the run so you can watch that final and see the time. I'm actually watching while I do this, by the way. Alright, cool. While I'm talking with Jay. I bought cheese board. Do I eat it? No, you just have it now. You have six inventory. cheese boards. No, Were I don't. Six? It's in my six? It's in my six slot. I was just being dumb. Just pee rain. Dang it, I missed Will. that. How? Uh, what, what Will should I get? Are you wearing Bowser's hat? Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's not a very... Cheese was invented before nice Jesus thing. was born in 8000 BC. Actually, God created cheese on the second day of uh, his creation stuff going on. You know, he was like, on the first he was like, let there be light or something like that. I don't remember exactly. And on the second I'm, he was like, let I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not Christian or anything, you know. But on the second day, he was like, let there be milk. And then on the third, he was like, let there be cheddar. It was specifically cheddar. Not cheese, just cheddar. And then on the fourth, he was like, oh, I forgot to add just cheese. So cheddar actually came before cheese. It's a misconception that the 
chicken comes before the egg, or the egg comes for, before the chicken, but it was actually uh, cheddar before the cheese. Yeah, and, and it's the cheddar that gave birth to the first chicken-egg hybrid, which then gave birth to the first egg. Uh, look, man, I, I have no clue what ever you typed means. Please! And this takes place within the place more, may I add. I speak a very, very minor amount of French, and I mean minor, and that's it's, it. It's Italian. I know, that's all I was saying, did like, you, I have no you, clue. Did you say mind. whatever the hell, or what the hell? Yes. I don't speak Spanish, sorry. Actually, that's not I Spanish. <laughs> I know that. I'm pretty sure that's Spanish. Is that Spanish? Yeah. I used to take Spanish class, but Okay, yeah, I that, that's Spanish. definitely Spanish. Uh, After the second sure. one he just dropped, that's definitely Spanish. Spanish is a more, uh, harder language. But German is super similar to English. It's actually, uh, the best term for it is, like, a, sib a sibling language. Because mm -hmm. they're from the same, so like, the term, is, the term, the actual term is sister language. Sibling works as well. No, Did James Charles invent that term? Terms. Well, it was close enough. Okay, also... Oh, nice, some German. That Are, I also you guys do? Are you asking how I am? Uh... I think I'm... Gut? Guten Tag. Well, that's good morning. Sure also, you, you spelled B-I's do wrong. That's verse diced. Maybe you're wrong. He seems like he's, like, quadrilingual. This is how you properly say it. If that's what you were trying to say. I think you should trust him. He seems like <clears throat> quadrilingual. Um, oh, I think... I'm not fluent in it, so... Okay, I have even like I I could kinda guess that first, but I have no I idea can, what that means. I can sing a song in German. Good on you. You're saying I cannot speak German. I literally just explained to you that I'm new to it, so I only know the basics. I can sing in it. In and I, I do understand now. Yes. that That's what the first one said, right? How do you feel about me being able to sing in German? I wish I could. I, mean, I, can I a am bit. not... What? Excuse me, that was really rude. Ooh, that's mean. Yeah, that's kind of mean. Um, you shouldn't be so that, rude. That was, have actually to not, that, that was actually not necessary. I don't recommend, like, saying that to people. Could you not? Like, that's not even as a joke. Like, that kind of pissed me off. I, I don't know if you're joking or not, but, like, no thanks. I'm not stupid. Okay, don't know what that means. <laughs> I feel so dumb here. I, mean, frankly, I don't yeah, think yeah. that counts as content. Let me Google translate this. I don't think that's content people enjoy. What uh, content people enjoy? I don't know what's being said him, here. Him calling me stupid in German. I mean, some people are into that. They really like, like, multi-language insults. Yeah, but why do people enjoy- I don't think people enjoy, like, me getting insulted. <laughs> it's just specifically you. You're too special. Do you want me to- Okay, fine. I'll- be quiet if you don't want me to. All right. Are you, tell are you ready, telling Keek? me not to? I wonder what the N word is in German. Oh, get it's ready, Keek. Get ready, Keek. Time's about I'm to watching. end. It's the same thing, by the way. Damn it. One thirty-eight twelve. Can we get a not round of an awesome run, but still a PB. freaking seven rainbows. Alrighty, yeah, that's. Round of applause! You got a new better PB. time than your original. Yeah, new PB. Wow. 
That's actually great. Good job. Thank you. Thank you. I wonder if I should keep going. It's almost one. Uh, yeah, something about night? No, Nicht is not. I love so. you. I, I love you too. <laughs> look, look. Look no, at him. Up. Oh, oh, you're telling Jay not to. Okay, okay, my brain. Wait, he's telling me? What? He's, he's telling you not to use Google Translate. Google Translate isn't actually, like, relatable. I recommend just learning how to speak German on your... I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Google Translate I isn't perfect. Care. It's not horrible. I'm gonna but... use Google Translate. Ori. I, also, did you know I-L-Y means I love you? I don't know if that's what you meant with that, but... Mm -hmm. He probably did, that's why I responded with I love you too, but like, no homo. He probably meant I love Youngus. That makes much more sense. I love Big Chungus Yellow. Oh, nope, never mind. Alright, he loves you. It's Mushroom oh, Kingdom. Oh, you, okay. Thank you, ba baby girl, baby man, 